It's time to finish what we started with some of the best episodes to ever be on TV. Five seasons, 62 episodes, and lots of analysis. Let's look at the meaning behind the title of each Breaking Bad episode in the second half of the final season. And we're going to settle the debate about the finale name once and for all. Isn't this awesome? That's wonderful. We start with episode 9, in which Jesse wants to give away his... Mm-hmm. What? It's like you said, it's blood money. Ice. It's my cut? But isn't it filthy blood money? <sighs> okay, yes, all right. I said that. I was trying to win an argument, all right? And I was wrong. This is your money. He does not listen. More license plate trivia. Here we've got Season 5, Breaking Bad, Episode 9, Part 2. And in the flash forward, we see 516, the finale episode where this car is a major plot point. You moved the money, didn't you? After burying his money, Walt commits the GPS coordinates to memory long enough to capture them in a lottery ticket. These GPS coordinates actually point to the Albuquerque studio that was the headquarters for the Breaking Bad crew. Another thing that's buried in this episode is the old bus that serves as Declan's meth lab. First, Hank wants Jesse to confess, but that doesn't work. So sure, that's how you want to play this? My name is Walter Hartwell White. We're led to believe this is a real confession. This is my confession. Until the later reveal. If you're watching this tape, I'm probably dead, murdered, by my brother-in-law, Hank Schrader. Hank has been building a meth empire for over a year now and using me as his chemist. It's really so smart how everything can be twisted to make it look like Hank was the mastermind. Hank took me on a ride-along and showed me just how much money even a small meth operation could make. I wound up paying his medical bills. To keep me in line, he took my children. Walt is as good of an actor as Brian Cranston. And for as nice of a house as this is, that is a terrible TV setup. Marie needs to take some interior decorating advice from Jesse, who wants Walt to confess that he doesn't care about just him. Just tell me you don't give a shit about me. It's either this or you'll kill me the same way you killed Mike. Look how Saul's lawyer up plate becomes wire up, foreshadowing the next episode. Finally, Saul confesses to taking Jesse's ricin cigarette. Yes, okay, I had you will lift your cigarette, but what made me? One day he showed up rabid. Saul suggests putting Jesse down like old Yeller. Oh, you mean you saw the movie? Do not float that idea again. Then Skyler does the same. Jesse isn't just some, some. Ah, here. Yes. Some rabid dog. At the end, Walt decides that Jesse is indeed some rabid dog. Todd, I think I might have another job for your uncle. By the way, when Jesse is staying with the Schraders, we see they own the DVD box set of Deadwood. That would have been interesting to see their reaction when Anna Gunn appears in it. Next to Deadwood, there's another set of DVDs sitting backwards. But in just one shot, we get a peek of the set magically facing the correct way. And it's Breaking Bad. Hank could have prevented a lot of deaths if he just popped that into the DVD player. This, this is art, Mr. White. Jesse, got my photo, bitch. This meme-worthy call takes us to... Tahashali, in the reservation west of town. You can tell Jesse's reading from a script because it's rare that he calls him Walt. This is the spot Walt buried his money and... The very first place we cooked, like, ever. Walt gets arrested. Walter White, you have the right to remain silent. Hey, baby, I got him. Dead to rights. You did it. Thank God. It's gonna be a little rough for the next couple weeks, but it'll get better. Hank is once again a hero. Leave me a while before I get home. I love you. I love you too. And I think everyone lives happily ever after. Oh wait, there's a little more that happens. Ozymandias is a poem recited here by Brian Cranston in an AMC promo for this final half season. Nothing beside remains, round the decay of that colossal wreck, boundless and bare, the lone and level sands stretch far away. It's about a fallen empire and the ego of its former king, a clear parallel to Walt. 
The King theme even appears when Walt drops off Holly at the fire station. Walt falling mirrors the fallen statue of Ramses II, which inspired the original Ozymandias poem. The episode ends with a stray dog running across the street, which makes me think the writers considered naming this episode Stray Dog to finish the dog title scheme. In this case, the stray dog represents Walt. But this episode was too important for such a silly name. Granite State is the official state nickname of New Hampshire. This is Lambert. Welcome to New Hampshire. Where you can live free or die. By the way, Lambert is Skylar's maiden name. Walt's life does resemble Granite right now. And Granite could be a continuation of the Ozymandias theme, referencing the fallen Granite statue. Kings do show up again. A king. Two kings. We've reached the finale. Er, Felina. Besides being an anagram for finale, it's Spanish for feline or cat-like, which could reference Walt's ability to evade authorities. The song on the radio, which Walt later hums, is about a cowboy who falls in love with a woman named Felina, gets shot by his enemies, and dies in her arms. So it's safe to say this is the primary meaning. People have often floated the idea that this also represents the elements iron, lithium, and sodium, meaning blood, meth, and tears. But there's a small problem with this. Lithium can be used to synthesize meth, but that's not how they do it in Breaking Bad. It's just basic chemistry. Thank you for joining me on this journey through all the Breaking Bad episode titles. I've got many more videos planned, including lots more to talk about in the Breaking Bad universe. If you like what you've seen so far, please subscribe. You're not going to want to miss the next video. Now, let's take a moment to appreciate all the episodes in Breaking Bad in a way you've never seen them before. See you.